it's your girl Tierra Marie, and you are watching Miss Drama on Miss Drama TV. Check me out. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I think this one for the radio. Yeah. Tierra Marie here, looking yes. very divine, very lovely. Thank you. We just came from the listening event, talking about the album. Mm -hmm. And, uh, of course, just to give us a, a recap a little bit, um, talk about when it's coming out again. It's coming out November 17th. Okay. Um, yes. So, okay. at that point, it's in stores, November 17th. At that point. Mm -hmm. yes. Now, um, first of all, the, the album, is, 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 as you mentioned, is an emotional journey, right? So talk about that emotional journey, um, coming from, you know, Rockefeller and, and all that you dealt mm -hmm. with. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Yeah, coming from that point up until now, um, how long did it really take you to regroup emotionally? Woo, that's a very good question. No one has ever asked me that. Mm -hmm. um, it took me maybe, <laughs> I got dropped when I was 18. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, it took me probably like a year and a half to regroup. Mm -hmm. I, had, I was living in Atlanta. Atlanta at the time. Mm -hmm. I had to go back to Detroit. I had to go back to my home roots, mm -hmm. get my support and love from my family and my friends. Mm -hmm. And um, then I was able to bounce back. Then I just got this bright idea to go to LA without a dime. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was like, you know what? I don't really have a lot of money, but I want to go to LA. Right. You know, I couldn't afford to put myself up in a hotel room. I, I just said, I want to go out to LA on a whim. And I did it. And everything just worked out. Okay. Um, now that you're you're progressing on, I mean, the album again is is, is very it's very evolved. I, I find that it's very evolved. Um, do you think that um, having this album out now, there's a lot of stress or pressure to to, I guess, have some results for these people who kind of maybe were doubting that Tierra Marie could bounce back. Um, you know what? I think that's already proven. Okay. I bounced back because I'm mm -hmm. not stressed out. I'm mm -hmm. happy. Okay. You know, I'm not in this rut anymore. Mm -hmm. So the bounce back part, the resilient part, is already mm -hmm. proven. Okay. You know, Tierra's resilient. Okay, we all know that. Mm -hmm. So now I just want to please the fans who are out there mm -hmm. and want music from me. Okay. And even the ones who are just curious to see what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. Hopefully they're pleased as well. Right. Now, talking about um, just, you know, as, as you said, you, you've moved on and you're doing, you're making this music and it's it's really exciting time for you right now. Um, it's also been an exciting time in hip hop. Um, mm -hmm. We know Jay, he did the, the Blueprint 3. Yes. Um, did you get a chance to hear it? What are your thoughts on it? How, how Actually, do you... I love that album. Mm -hmm. I can't even lie. I love it. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, I like uh, Shorty. Oh, uh, Venus versus Mars. Yeah, I like that. Okay. <laughs> I like that song. Awesome. So and I like New York too. Okay. Well, no, the Empire, Empire State, State of Mind, right? Yeah. Alicia Keys. Um, talking a little bit about that. Um, have you talked to to anybody from Rockefeller? Has, is is there is there like a a piece now? Has that bridge been kind of re, you know rebuilt to some way? Yeah, but I had to build it myself. Um, I didn't build it with any help from anybody on the other side. I just mm -hmm. had to build it myself because. I had to tell myself that it's a possibility that you may never talk to these people again, you know. So are you going to be emotionally d distraught for mm -hmm. that whole period, like for mm -hmm. your whole life if you never talk to them again? Mm -hmm. So I had to build that bridge myself. And I did, and I think I did pretty well. I did end up speaking to Dre, I mean, Dre, to Jay through mm -hmm. email. Um, he had a concert in Detroit, and my mom went out, and he was just very nice to her. So I just thought that I should send him a thank you, and he and just let you know, you know, it was all good. And, you know, he said a couple of other things, but I won't go into depth. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it was just, it was nice. And I seen Tata not long ago, and it was all nice. It's okay. always going to be nice. That's It's politics, you right. know. And I understand that now as a young woman. Mm -hmm. So I'm happy that I have that understanding. Right. And and I see there's definitely a, a you're very mature with it. You're very um professional with it. I see that. I get that from you. Um being professional is not always easy. Has there ever been ever a while at moment from Tierra Marie? Have you ever had a moment where you've been like, you know what? Got to take a little bit to the other side. Has there been a moment when when you actually did have a I mean, just in, in um, honesty. Not, not really in um in public. Mm -hmm. But I always have those. I mean, this industry, first of all, I'm just going to keep it 100% real right now. Mm -hmm. This industry is so fake. It's so phony. And I'm not saying.
saying the people individually mm -hmm. are fake and phony, but the whole industry, like the business is fake mm -hmm. and phony. Mm -hmm. And it's just like, if you don't know how to play the game, then you're going to file out and you won't be playing anymore. Mm -hmm. So you have to, you have to keep your composure. So there's every night I go home, I'm probably screaming about something to my close immediate friends and family. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But I never lose my composure in public. Awesome, awesome. And talking about composure, recently the VMAs, mm -hmm. um, you know, I, I, I'm bringing this up partly because I know Kanye is on your album. Oh, okay, because I'm laughing about Little Mama. Okay, but yeah, we'll get into that too. But um, let's start. Let's start with Kanye. Kanye's on the album. How long ago was that set up? Was that prior to? Uh, how many years was, was that recent, or was that something that happened a while ago? Um, that's that was this year, but um, yeah, it was like earlier this year. And what's year. the name of that track? So people are aware of Diamonds. That? It's Diamonds. Diamonds. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, um, talking about the VMAs. Okay. Um, they were very recent. You, you know, dealt with Kanye before. Was that kind of, kind of just out out of context, or were you like? Okay, I can understand where he's coming from. How, what are your thoughts on that whole thing? Because well, you've got received a lot of flack for it. Everybody has an opinion. Mm -hmm. I just felt like there's a time and a place, you know, for your opinion to be expressed. And mm -hmm. especially if you have a blog, then that's probably <laughs> the most appropriate time and place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, of course, I'm with the majority on this, which is rare for me, but I am with the majority on this. I think that it was disrespectful, but he apologized, and what more can he do? Other right. than apologize. So you forgive him? As, as of course. Such. She forgave him. So mm -hmm. everybody else has to forgive him. Right, right. She right. forgave him. It's over with. Mm -hmm. Now people can just let it go. Right. You know, it was, it was a mistake that he made. You know, um, mm -hmm. he was drinking. Everybody could see that. Everybody knows when you're under the influence, you can do some crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> blame it on the al 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 alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> and as far as little mama, were you surprised by that? That she. I was <laughs> flabbergasted by Lil Mama. I just, I couldn't believe it. And she was posing up there too. I mean, yes, I just couldn't believe that one right there. I'm like, how? what's up with the security, the stage security? <laughs> you know, like anybody could have went out on that stage. Right. I'm like, wow. Like she walked up there. I mean, <laughs> my thing is, <laughs> did you see her strutting down the runway to get to the stage? <laughs> like she strutted down. I'm like, Right. It was just funny. I mean, it was funny. It was funny. I'm sure it wasn't funny to Jay, but mm -hmm. it was funny. Okay. And, and and you talked about a blog. Now, do you have a, a blog or a site? Or, or how, how are you? Are you in this social networking thing right now? I am on Twitter. Uh, my Twitter name is Tierra underscore Monroe. Mm -hmm. um, I love Marilyn Monroe, so that's where that comes from. Uh -huh. But, um, yeah, I do have Twitter. Blogging um, or anything like that? No, I'm not blogging. I'm okay. not blogging. I want to actually start a video blog site, so I probably will do that. Okay, but so we can right look. at this point, I'm not. Okay, all right, and of course the album again. The album at that point, November seventeenth. November seventeenth. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Perfect. Ooh, that's sweet, incredible, you.